Okay, we're checking out the only game that doesn't hide that it is a giant whirlpool of drugs. It's braining. Supposedly this is one of the games where you have to use your skills of perception and intellect in order to find the cheater, for instance. Except the people that made this game don't use any tact. Oh, and today's flesh-eating insanity is sponsored by Dying Light 2. But because talking about it would be boring, I'm gonna cut a laptop in half with a 12-foot pole saw. More on that later. That is the face of a man who has been abused by the gaming industry for years. They were like, hey, do you wanna be a star in a new game coming out? And he was like, yeah, wait a minute. Now he's standing across from an incredibly broad-shouldered Taylor Swift. Obviously, in order to find the cheater, I guess I have to guess where she is. There's a pair of feet behind a curtain and some blinking eyes under the bed. What does this mean? This means that she has to be behind this painting of these two trees robbing this tiny house. Why do you say that, Gray? I Listen, I don't know why there are two trees that massively overshadow the sad house. Is there anything behind this? There is not. How about under the rug? Okay, maybe it is the eyes. It was not the eyes. I'm not gonna lie, they went all out on the PowerPoint presentation animations. Also, what is on his shirt? Are these like syringes? Has she already stabbed him with shards of glass? All right, I guess she has to be behind here. No? What the hell? Where the hell is this woman? Oh, you can move things. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Let's scare them a bit. How? What do you want me to tell? What do you want me to say that she's pregnant? This popcorn is made with fresh cocaine. I'm not gonna lie. If I click on this TV and the ring girl jumps out and drops kick both of these people, this game, I'm gonna give this game five stars. Oh, it's her. She's coming. Do the drop kick. Come on, do it. Do the drop kick. Come on, pull your ass out of there. Come on. Come on. Nothing's happening. What do you, what do you, what do you want, the popcorn? And why does their rug look like someone murdered a titan made out of maple syrup? What do I have to do? Oh, I can't, I can literally yank her out of the TV. Damn it, if only she was sideways, I could have gotten the drop kick in. Which one is not ice cream? Oh, no. <laughs> I mean, I would expect the one that smells like fecal material. It, it almost feels like they hired three different artists for these three different women. Alrighty, girls, who wants blood poisoning? Oh, I just clicked on something. I'm supposed to show the evidence? The evidence is the fact that 20 minutes from now, her vital organs will start shutting down. Can I pull any of this. Hold on, I have an idea. Aha! Alright, ready? I love that the tongue is sticking out. She's trying so hard, dude. She's like, I don't care, I paid for this. Stop! Who is being lazy? Harry Potter. I don't know who's being lazy, but I know who's wearing my niece's jeans. All three of these people. Okay, so do I... I guess you lift up the stick? Aha! Yay! I appreciate that this guy's not concerned, but this dude's looking directly at me, and it's a bit creepy. I'm a winner. Who is rich? This isn't the question we should be asking. The question we should be asking is, how did this guy get like a 42 ounce steak in prison? I would think it's this guy because of the wine, but I feel like I, this is the type of game where I would click on him and they'd be like, no, he's not rich. He just has cancer. Can I move the table? I feel like I would be able to, aha. See this? He's playing on a damn cell phone. You've got to be rich if you can sneak those in. No, you just can't be worried about getting your ass kicked by the prison guards. Who is his girlfriend? How come I have to be the one to decide this? Also, I have to take a moment to mention, this guy looks like a young Matthew Broderick. Do I have to like beat the girls with coconuts in order to determine their faithfulness? It's also weird how they can never finish a floor. It's just like the grass is bleeding from this palm tree. Okay, do I, I don't know, do I? Do I like just drag someone to- Okay, he doesn't like her. I mean, his socks match her starfish. This means something. Bam. Oh, nope, all right, maybe not. Maybe he's in love with the palm tree. Maybe he's a narcissist. He's in love with himself. Okay, maybe it's this girl. This is the gaming laptop that I'm going to play Dying Light 2 on. This is the 12 foot long pole saw that I use to kill zombies that try and infect my gaming laptop. Just like pole saws can show the insides of a zombie, Techland just showed some of the insides of Dying Light 2 on their show Dying to Know. There's interviews with developers, new gameplay trailers, a look at some of the various weapons that are used. Dying Light 2 has all kinds of stuff like a vast open world, a full day night cycle, and choices that have consequences. I'm the type of person that makes terrible choices because they have the ability to affect the Dying Light 2 world and ruin everyone's life together. You know what time it is. Let's pulse off a freaking laptop. Imagine this, you're enjoying playing Dying Light 2 with its brutal and creative combat when all of a sudden one of the freaking chest opening zombies infects your laptop. That means it's time to put it out of its misery. <laughs> Dying late too, son!
Anyway, if you want to check out Dying Light 2, check out the link in the description below. I feel like I learned something, and what I learned was how to hate this game. Which one is the bad teacher? Like, bad with 1D or 2? I, I don't know, this one kind of looks like Hermione in platforms, and is this lady holding a club with a nail through it? It's like the classic Bugs Bunny 2x4 with a nail. You never know though, she might just have like, resting murder face. She's over here, she's like, YOU! did a fantastic job, you get an A. And if you don't like it, I'll cave your skull in with this. Can I like move things around? Or do I just have to take a guess? I'm still very curious about this club. Oh. Oh! Not like a bad human, more like a person who's bad at instructing children. What did you get? Okay, I don't know what else to say. Hotter teachers equal better grades. Which one will escape prison? I'm more concerned about how they both managed to get almost the same painting of a sad snake, like constricting a watermelon. I mean, they both look fairly happy. Is there something underneath this? Ah, uh, no. The weight? Can I give you the weight? Can I bring the weight over here? Oh, I can actually give you both weights. Here, don't, don't look at me. All right, how about anything behind the mirror? Anything behind the painting? Anything behind the toilet? Aha! Is there anything behind your stuff? You got nothing. Hold on, let me see something. You don't get a toilet anymore either. <laughs> You're left with nothing. Go, my son. It's time to lose weight, okay? Would I have to like make him run? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Is it working? Nope, he's he's the same. Hey, eh? what do I if what well, like if I cut his hands off, then he can't eat. Is that where is that where this is going? You want jumping jacks? Oh, it worked! <laughs> Whose turn is it to get married? I don't know. I mean, this girl has the most teeth showing, so I guess her. I gotta show my evidence. Oh! Oh, damn it! I was gonna throw it back over here. I didn't realize this lady had like Jedi mind powers. This isn't fair. Who is cheating on the exam? I don't know, but I know, I know who's given up. You ever have one of those tests where it was like a hundred questions and you couldn't answer like any of the first 10 and you just said, you know what? I'm gonna look outside for a while and pretend this isn't happening. That is me. Am I the cheater? I am not. I also have to mention this young man's pencil looks like a scalpel. Is, is she whispering to him or is she picking her nose? Do you have anything underneath your paper? No. How about you? Okay. Maybe it's not cheating on the exam. Maybe it's cheating during the exam. Maybe the teacher is off cheating. Ah! Maybe you should study instead of cheating, buddy. I studied and I went to college and you know what it got me? Debt. Who is lying? Would this guy like just wake up from a coma and now he has two women saying that they're married to him? This lady wearing like a choker made of $50 bills? I love, this guy's probably like, I remember everything, but I'm going to pretend I don't. All right, can I take his saline? Whoa, the whole damn scene moves? Is there a third woman? Hold on, I'm just curious. Is there anything else I can move around here? No, the whole scene moves. Dad. Oh, is that what again? Maybe I just sit too far from my monitor, but that looks like a prehensile carrot perched on top of this girl's shoulder. All right, guess you're married to the lady that has a tattoo of a heart and a violent crab. What is there more? I thought I figured it out. This is clearly deeper than I had previously anticipated. You hiding something underneath the covers like a third woman here. <laughs> I clicked on the other lady and that's the right answer. And it actually does say, I actually remember everything. <laughs> Who is her husband? I mean, he has the weakest chin, so maybe him. Seriously, his facial features are like so scrunched he could lick his own eyelid. Is it him? Can I move these things around? Oh, what the hell? There's a, there's a human behind here. Oh, that's just like the girl from the beginning of the game. I guess she really does have resting murder face. Who is in danger? What is happening here? Are these girls getting abducted? Is that a ring of fire? I feel like this scene needs more context. I don't know. Is there... <laughs> I can't show my evidence. I don't know what's supposed to- What the hell? Oh. Oh, it's a mirror. Oh! <laughs> this David Hasselhoff looking like to shank this girl. This is my evidence. What else do you want? Okay, how about now? There we go. Help the man escape the room. Uh. Okay. Oh. A. Huh. I mean, this tiger's head is really big compared to its body, so maybe it's not that fast. Can I just put him into the fire? <laughs> I'm gonna make him experience all of hell before I try and work this out. All right, so, um, damn it. Okay, grab the bucket. Okay, now go get the water. There. Put it on the fire and take the rope and, and hang, hang yourself, yourself with it. it. All right, maybe we just put the fire all the way out. I did it. Maybe that college wasn't a waste. I'm just kidding. It was. What? Logic? Or sentiment? Are you... So, what do you... 
<laughs> What's what, what are we doing here? What is, what is this supposed to be? Where's this second cord coming from? Here. There you go. Oh crap, I got my cords mixed up. Oh, I can't take them out. Oh, wait, maybe I'm not supposed to. Maybe they were supposed to be combined. Did I win? I did it! Like by accident. Who is pregnant? I don't know, maybe everyone just, just smuggling packs of frozen chicken fingers from Walmart. The real question is how exactly are we doing this pregnancy test? Is there like a thing here? Oh, did I just slap this watermelon out of this woman's stomach? This game is like, there's only one way to learn the truth. Through felonies. Okay, how about you? Oh, it's a pillow. I mean, this doesn't mean anything. This girl could only be like two weeks pregnant. How about you? Oh, see now if I developed this game, this lady would try and bludgeon this woman to death with her watermelon and this woman would try and smother this lady with her pillow. Who is lying? You're not pregnant. I'm eight months pregnant. I don't know. The ultrasound up here looks like a melting ice cube. All right, so I guess we take the ultrasound wand and then we wave it over the fetus. Now we will wave it over this girl's head. Are you getting cancer yet? There's no other children around here, is there? All right, I think I've, I think I've discovered the... Why? Oh my god, I just got brainonated. It's not who's telling the truth, it's who's lying. Who's a dumbass? It's Gray! Whose boyfriend is rich? I assume her, because she's at least been in two of the different brainings. Is this like a peacock inside of her bag? One million dollars! Okay, how about, what, how about this? Three hundred thousand dollars. Three hundred thousand dollars for a necklace? Pleb wear. How about your shoes? Are they expensive as well? Oh, everyone just has one item. Okay, and how about your ring? $500,000. Okay, so the, the survey would say that it's this one. I was right for once. Which gate should he choose to survive? Probably this one because the shark looks like it's about to cry. No? I mean, he has a torch, so I guess he can survive in the snow biome. Not, oh. <laughs> or he could just go straight to Florida. Help her survive. What is happening? It's like a tiger ripped straight out of Google Images. Two alligators that look, that honestly look like they were drawn by me. And what is this, like a two-headed snake? Honestly, take your chances with the derpy alligators. If I made them, there's, there's a good chance that they can't actually function in normal society. So can I, oh, I can literally move the snake. I can just make the snake fly. Get out of here. All right, how about the tiger? Nope, can't do that. I can definitely make the snake fly. There. Okay, how about if I make the snake battle the tiger? Oh, it truly worked! See, and the alligators didn't do shoot! Who is lying? She's only 15, I'm 30. Said no woman ever. What is that? Is that like a little dog head this lady's choking out in her handbag? Can't click on any of this. Oh, is her like ID in here? Yeah. Hey, little being. Your mother's a liar. Who is lying? You're cheating on me. I love you. Is that a price tag inside of these flowers? They actually drew this face perfectly. This lady is like, yeah, I love you. Or do I? Oh, it says I miss you. She's telling the truth. Which one is not a nurse? Probably this one, because it looks like this child is swaddled in melted butter. See, she's not a nurse, she's a cannibal. So, I assume I can remove or move something here. Ah, is this like her nurse ID? Okay, how about you? Okay, is that her nurse ID? What is this gonna be, like your prison photo? <laughs> <laughs> you got rid of your fantastic mustache or you're a cannibal. Which zombie is his ex? I'm not gonna lie, I was waiting for a new type of brain teaser and this game did not disappoint. I don't think I've ever had to find out which undead woman was originally in a relationship with this guy. Okay, so there's a few things I have to mention here. Uh, first off, now this zombie does have a picture of someone that may or may not be this individual. Uh, but right here, you can see that these two got tattoos together. And now, after he butchers his undead ex-lover, he can rip her arm off and keep it with him always. This has got to be it, right? Also, I just have to say, because it's somewhat concerning, this lady's dress looks like it's melting off of her body. Nothing unusual considering the game. Booyah! What would you do if your girlfriend was a zombie? I don't know, but a pole saw would probably be involved. Who is lying? I'm your wife, my boyfriend. Well, first off, this lady didn't even have a complete sentence. Also, like, how come every time a guy ends up in the hospital, he comes out with two wives? Where is this hospital at? He's in there with like a sprained wrist. He doesn't even have a head injury. I don't even think he's that surprised that these two women are both claiming to be his wife. I think he's like, your head is huge. All right, so I'm assuming that there has to be something here inside this purse. No, how about this? Aha, see, a bracelet, and he's wearing the same one. That clearly doesn't mean that they shop at the same accessory store. This means that they're married. 
Now we're on paternal rivalry. I'm your mom, my daughter. This girl's like 25. How did we get to this point? She's probably like, I don't want either of you to be my mom. I went through so much abuse growing up that I forgot all about that part of my life. What's the key here? This lady's slightly thinner than this lady. Does it mean something? Who would fight over an adult daughter too? This, this daughter's probably just gonna rack up a ton of student loans. Is the answer tears? Uh, let's see here. Sometimes the answer is boobs, but not today. Are you, is there like some sort of, can I move her electric bolts? I also realized that this game doesn't even try and injure its people anymore to make them forget that they had someone in their life. At this point, it's just normal now for people to come up to a person and be like, I'm your mom. No, it's me. Aha. It makes me sad because I feel like this lady cares more about this girl than this one does, but find the cheater. We have reached new levels. This game began with this girl and it's like ending with this girl. Her boyfriend is now running away with a mermaid. Well, whatever swimming away. Her face is so red, her head's about to spontaneously combust. Can I move this? It's a cardboard cutout. Is that the hammer of Thor? What is this doing here? Can I beat someone with this? All right, how about in here? Nope, nothing. Oh, can I beat this? Up? There we go. It's the same guy and the same girl. It's the same love triangle. <laughs> Give up already, you always get caught. Well, I wasn't sure if I needed to see that man's crazy face again, but the game decided for me. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Braining. Until the next time, stay foxy and much love.